My name's Kevin Hutton, a professional ground trainer for 13 years now. This is our kennels in Burford, Oxfordshire, where we train around 70 racing grounds. Our team are, are very important to us here. Obviously, it's a, it's a big team effort. We've, um, we've a lot of dogs to care for. So there's myself as trainer, my fiance Donna Witchells as assistant trainer. Um, we've got Aidan Hills and Chloe full-time with us. Um, and we have a really good support of, of part-time staff that come in. Number one priority is always the, the welfare of the dogs here. Uh, the well-being, make sure they're ha healthy, happy and content, and that's our main thing. I mean, I feel like we treat them better than we treat ourselves most of the time. I feel like we spoil them, and that's exactly what they need. I think there's a lot, a lot of skills going into to being a trainer, especially working with animals. You obviously need to be very kind, very patient remembering that you only really get out of it what you put in, it's the same with almost anything in life. We get to the kennels for seven o'clock, we put the boiler on to start cooking the meat and veg for the day, prepare the meat and the biscuit. Kennels are always start at half seven on the dock, so every dog would go into the paddocks while the kennels are cleaned, waters are changed, beds are fluffed up. So the beds here we have like four or five DVs on each bed. They're comfy enough that I'd sleep in them. They all love them and cuddle up at night. It keeps them nice and warm. I think it's lovely that they have DVs. Every dog is walked and then we will do the galloping. Um, the dogs love to gallop. It's their favourite thing to do. And then for about two or three hours we start the grooming, injury treatments that might need doing. Feeding is a, is a huge part of what we do. I believe it's the most important part of ground training is to get the feed right. They get chicken breast every day, raw beef every day. We use a lot of fresh vegetables, so uh, beetroot, banana, spring greens, cabbage, tomatoes, all goes into a nice soup every day. And it's, it's something we take very seriously. Yeah, they get fresh eggs from the farm and honey as well. So you need to make sure you feed the right things to, to keep the dog healthy. And, uh, and that certainly shows you know, in their coats and their condition. On a personal level, when you produce winning dogs and you've put in the effort, it's, it's exactly what you do it for. It's, it feels like the dog's rewarding you. It was an exceptional moment to win the derby with Dorota's Wildcat. I was extremely proud. It was a lot of work, let me tell you. But, wow, didn't he ever deliver. You don't get any prouder than that. The most exciting thing I've ever done. You build up such a bond with them, you know, they, they get to know you, you get to know them inside out. Grounds are the most loving animal, they're so loyal, so loving, they're so kind and they're just wonderful dogs to work with and um, yeah, really it's special to have a nice bond with them.